Well, I think our experience has been that community doesn't happen unintentionally. You really have to make it a priority in your life. And so a week or a month goes by very quickly. And if you don't put something in place in that week to intentionally connect you with others, you might find that you're isolated more quickly than you realize. My first real sense of community here was a women's Bible study on Tuesday morning. And those women welcomed me and they loved me and they loved my baby daughter. One of the first things that we did was to join a small group and that has definitely been um, the single greatest factor in us feeling like feeling at home here. And when I came here I needed relationship more than anything else and so relationship and personal growth. So I enjoyed obviously the teaching but there are so many opportunities for me to connect with people. You guys know I love Vacation Bible School. And one of the sweetest things I found is early on when I was at Peace, I was invited to participate in that. And not only did I make lots of connections, I love the sense of community that happens when you serve in a ministry like that. Yeah, so I wanted to be a hermit living in the woods. And then I, as I got older, I realized I need people, I want people, I enjoy people around me. And this was in college, I guess, I was involved in InterVarsity Christian Fellowship, which the best friends today 30 years later are my InterVarsity Christian Fellowship friends. Because I was met with love and acceptance, what happened is that there was just a natural desire on my part to want to show that in this community where I'd been planted. When I went to the men's advance, that was probably the first place that I think I really began to feel connected. You see these people at church on Sunday mornings and we're all sitting in rows and we go from sitting in rows in small groups to sitting in a circle. It's easy to feel like, okay, does it really matter if I go? It really doesn't matter if I go, and it does really matter.